Yeah, I'm back. It's another video. GP sneakers. Had these sitting in the closet for a while. Nike blazer low, Sakai's British tan colorway with the university red. My size. Good friend of mine looked out for me. Gave me these. Well, sold me them rather for retail. He didn't like them. Hit them on his Nike sneakers app. So look at the box. You know, show you how the box look. 100% legit. Ooh, that glare is crazy. But yeah, we're gonna get right to it. Sneakers out the box already, I took them out. These is them right here. A lot of people didn't like them. You could tell by the resale value. That's that's how stuff is gauged now. I guess if, if it's not upcharged crazy, either it wasn't rare, or people, the masses didn't have a crazy want for them. And that's cool with me, I love that, because I'm able to get some sneakers that I like without having to jump through hoops. You know, it's crazy right now trying to get sneakers for retail, especially at Jordan. Well, I'm grab the sneakers up one by one this time. I forgot to do that in my last video. Go back to my last video, like, comment, subscribe. I had the comments off, you know, I'm a rookie right now. I'm trying to get my experience up with this uploaded from YouTube. Grab the sneaker one by one. Let me show you. It got the the nice hairy-ish suede leather and suede mixture. Double stack sneaker. I know the one sneaker is a Nike Saclai blazer. It's chopped off. Expo exposed foam. Double tongues. I don't know what the other sneak is. Next time I get a blazer, I'll make sure I have that information. If it's if it's stacked like this. Cause not all blazers come like this. Grab the left shoe. It's this this shoe, even though all in all is the old school shoe. Doesn't have any crazy air bubbles or technology. It definitely is made well. I don't really see too many flaws, and I mean, well, let's not even say that. <laughs> I don't see any noticeable flaws because none of these sneakers is perfect. None of these sneakers is perfect. They all got mistakes in the retail, aftermarket which comes from retail, sometimes China, who knows? But yeah, even the bootleg sneakers, they, they, they're not really a big difference from retail. Everything come with a little imperfection. These is good though. We'll bust these out in the summertime or the springtime when it's nice weather. Quick video for y'all. I'm going to pick up some more sneakers today. I had hit on them, them, um, them Blue Racer 5s. I don't know if I want to keep them or not, but I got to get my flex points back up. <laughs> Comment down below if you don't like the flex system. <laughs> you know, you know. Yeah, double laces. British 10, University Red. If you can't tell, they look aged. Like it's a, it's an aged color to them. It's not a deep red. More of an infrared colorway. Like they doing a lot. But appreciate y'all for watching the video. Like, comment, subscribe. That's free 99. No money out your pocket. I appreciate it. I'm going to keep coming with more videos for y'all. All right. Peace.